Good morning, friends. Once again, I, Andrew Ford, come to you to clear up more of my brother's new provincial restrictions. My friends, the sun is rising. Our beautiful sun is high in the sky, and if you stare hard and long enough, you'll notice that the darkness is far from over. My friends, we can now come out of the province-wide shutdown, although the majority of this province will stay in shutdown for another two weeks. My most cherished friends, we will gradually and safely reopen uh, and return to normal by opening up businesses store by store, employee by employee, and schools teacher by teacher, and student by student, starting with the cool kids. My small business friends, we will be allowing non-essential businesses to reopen so that you can have a 25% capacity so that you may operate just like all the other businesses have for the last month and a half. If there's any confusion about that, just know that 25% of your arm, 25% of your body, is your right arm. My traveling friends, we will continue to frown upon all non-essential travel and enforce mandatory testing at the borders along with a mandatory two-week no-expenses-paid vacation at the Radisson. So that way, whatever money you have left, you can put into your own economy. You will, however, be treated to a buffet-style dinner, and Dougie and I will come and join you. To my brother's real friends, uh, he will see you tonight at our place for the Puppy Bowl recap party, where we will celebrate the win of the Pomeranian Palm Brady. Lastly, my Ontario friends. I believe we are not out of the woods yet. I believe we are just found ourselves into a new set of woods, one that is warmer and nicer and cozier, but is still filled with bullshit. So, my friends, keep up the good work. Until next month's shitstorm, stay home, stay safe, and stay delirious. We will now not be taking any more questions because, as it is quite clear, we still know nothing. God bless, and le fromage.